Hi guys, how are you guys? Um, I hope everyone's having a great day. I just really wanted to come on and talk about the wrap a little bit. Um, and also go over some tips and tricks on how to utilize the wraps so they work out for you well and so you don't feel like you're spending a lot of money. Um, I get a lot of people saying, well, I have to keep wrapping. Do I have to eat good? Um, how many wraps does it take? All these fun questions, and I'm here to answer those now. So the wrap comes in this little pouch, and it comes in a box like this. If you become a customer, you get four per box. If you buy single wraps from a distributor, you get one like this, or however many you buy. The wrap is made to tighten, tone, and firm your skin. Um, it is made to help with problem areas. It is made to incorporate into a healthy lifestyle. If you want to buy wraps and you know you are a whole horrible eater, you know you, um, you hate you just cannot stop eating fast food. You, you love drinking pop, all those things. I don't suggest you start with wraps. I suggest you start with a cleanse and try to get your body really clean and stuff. The wraps, I don't suggest you start with these if you have problems letting go of certain foods. Um, reason being because wraps, um, the best way to explain it is that um, we put toxins in our body and toxins make us you know, they make us fat, they make us bloat, they make us whatever. So the wrap is going to tighten, tone, and firm your skin, but the solutions in the wrap um, are just amazing for you. So they're really going to help you slim, um, lose some inches, and tighten, tone, and firm your skin. It's not guaranteed that you'll lose inches. Everyone is different. Um, sometimes it just tightens, tones your, your skin. Um, you know, everyone is different, like I said. Um, but when you use the wraps, you really don't have to... Uh, people are always like, well, do I have to, like, stop eating or do I just eat salad? The, the answer is no. I have wrapped and ate. I eat good dinner. I eat bread. I eat certain things. I just try to avoid fast food and junk food and anything high in toxins. Um, try to avoid alcohol for 72 hours after you wrap. If you do have one drink or two and you wrap the day before or something like that, you want to make sure you're still drinking a lot of water to get all that flushed out. So when you wrap, all you need to do is apply the wrap for 45 minutes or up to eight hours. You're going to drink half of your body weight in ounces of water. And um, the, the day you wrap, you just want to start, you know, start drinking water and then try to drink a water bottle before you take your wrap off. Um, if you're going to leave it on overnight, really hydrate yourself before you go to bed. When you wake up, drink more water. And then for the next couple of days, try to really just drink like – three, four water bottles, whatever half of your body weight in water is, and just try to avoid fast food and junk food. That's mostly all I tell my customers. Avoid fast food. Avoid junk food. We really want you to not waste your money. I don't want you calling me telling me the wrap didn't work. Um, if you are not following all the wrapping rules, you're not going to have good wrapping results. Just like if you go to the gym and you eat bad and you eat junk and you leave the gym and you go have a Big Mac, you're not going to have good results. Same thing. So, I really encourage you that if you are not, uh, if you're really bad at letting go of bad food, or you have a really bad addiction, um, I suggest that you just cut it out slowly and you try one of our other products that's going to help you have, ex you know, the weight loss that you want. Um, but if you are looking to tighten, tone, and firm, lose inches, um, really tighten your stomach, your thighs, get rid of cellulite, get rid of stretch marks. Any of that stuff, you want, to, you want to go with the wrap. If you have cellulite, you want to go with the wrap. Um, um, you can put this anywhere from your neck down on your body. Um, i trying to remember what other questions that I get. Yeah. Do you have to keep wrapping once you have done a 90-day challenge or once you use one treatment? That question is a very good question, and I can't say if you're going to have to keep wrapping or not. You don't have to keep wrapping for the rest of your life. Um, I wrap and I will wrap for the rest of my life because I love the wraps and I can use them anywhere from the neck down. And I mean, there's always an area in your body where you want to improve. So, but if you can't, you know, if you just don't want to wrap forever, which you will want to, because you're going to love these. Um, basically you maintain by eating good. Like I said a little bit ago, um, you want to wrap until you get your desired results and you want to wrap one area until 
you get your desired results before you move on to another problem area. You don't want to use one wrap on your arms and then just be like, okay, well now I'm going to try my stomach and now I'm going to try my thighs. You really want to do one whole treatment in one area before you move on to another area. Um, one full treatment is four wraps. Um, basically, just drink a lot of water. Like I said, avoid fast food and junk food. And that's what has worked for me. Everyone is different. Um, I've heard of some girls... I've actually heard of another girl, she's, you know, wrapped and um, she still eats normal and she has amazing results. She'll eat whatever she wants. Um, these are just things that I know have worked for me and have worked for every customer that I've told to follow these rules. And if they follow them, they get amazing results. Um, so you don't have to completely starve yourself and eat salad, but you do want to avoid toxin, a lot of toxins, which is fast food, junk food, soda. Like I just said, coffee. Um, if you do drink coffee also, you just want to make sure you're still hydrated and you're drinking a lot of water. Okay. Now, a few tricks that I wanted to talk about is um, one that I get often is, well, do I have to buy the fab wrap? It's another $5. And the answer is no, you don't have to buy the fab wrap. You can hold the wrap down with anything that you have. Um, the saran wrap is just made to hold the wrap down. I get a lot of people saying, well, of course you're going to lose inches. You're sweating. Um, no. Our saran wrap is meant to hold the wrap down, and it's not meant to help us lose inches. We actually don't want you to sweat with your wrap on. We want you to, um, you know, release what's in your body. We don't want you to sweat it out. We don't want sweat. We just want the solutions in the wrap to hydrate into your skin. That's it. So this is just the cheaper route. You don't have to buy fab wrap. It's five extra dollars if you can afford it. Super awesome stuff, breathable cloth, super fancy, super comfortable, super flexible, everything. It's just an amazing, um, I'm sorry, I believe it's five or six dollars. I'm not sure now. They changed the price, so I'd have to go look. But anyways, trick, trick, trick. Everybody tells me it's hard to wrap my arms. It's hard to wrap my thighs. Super simple. Cut your saran wrap in half. And this works wonders. You don't have to worry about wrapping a big old, you know, wrap thing around your arms. You cut your saran wrap in half and you have a mini wrapper like the fab wrap. Super perfect size. Um, just enough to wrap to where it holds the wrap down. If you are going to be laying in one spot for a while, like when you go to bed and you know you stay on your back, put the wrap on and you're good. You don't need to have anything holding it as long as you're not moving around and you know you're going to be in the same place. Um, if you're laying around watching a movie, you throw wrap on your stomach. You don't have to really put anything on it, like I said, if you know you're going to be in one spot. So that was one tip that I really wanted to give. Um, the next tip that I want to give is um, how to use the wrap and how to make it so, like I said, it's worth it. You're getting your money's worth, and you use it in more than just your stomach. Um, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to wrap my stomach and I'm going to wrap my sides. And I'm going to show you guys how I utilize one wrap into a combo wrap um, for my problem areas. Uh, you can cut one wrap up. Um, I know of a girl that cuts it up and she uses it for her chin and she cuts it up. She cuts it into um, eight pieces and she puts the rest in a Ziploc bag and puts it away. She wraps, she puts a piece of um, wrap on her chin once a week. And so she can tighten and tone her chin, um, get rid of her double chin or whatever. I thought it was a super good idea to put it in a saran wrap. So you want to keep the solutions really moisturized. The wraps are only available to use one time. You're supposed to wear it one time, throw it away. They're not reusable. Um, but like I said, if you're cutting it up in little beatsy pieces for different areas on your body, you can put it in a saran wrap or in a Ziploc bag and save it. Okay. Uh, I don't remember what else. I think I finished up on, do you have to keep wrapping? Just basically you want to maintain by eating healthy. You don't have to keep wrapping for the rest of your life. Um, your, your, your results will stay as long as you maintain. Um, if you don't maintain, they will return. Um, wraps um, are amazing way to um, tighten, tone, and firm very fast. And also help, um, like I said, stretch marks better light. And they're really going to help those problem areas. And also, um, the wrap just really helps with, um, also, just, you just feel amazing when you use these. Like, I can't even explain how you feel. Like, they're relaxing. Um, they make you feel really good. Um, 
You just want to make sure you're drinking a lot of water, like I said. So anyways, I'm just going to wrap myself and get this video over with because I talk a lot sometimes. So I really just wanted to make this informational and fun. So the first thing that I did before I'm going to wrap right now, I took a hot shower and I just got ready for the day a little while ago. So I took a really hot shower. Um, I've been drinking water all morning because I knew I was going to wrap today. And um, I used a body exfoliator and I really scrubbed my stomach. Um, so you want to get something to exfoliate in the shower if it's a scrubber. Um, you want to use no body wash in the area where you're going to wrap. You really want to avoid putting anything on there because you don't want to clog your pores. And um, you want to make sure that the pores are clean and they are open. If you get home and you're going to wrap and you don't, you're not going to take a shower, what I suggest you do is you get a hot cloth, wet it with the hottest water that you can, wipe down the area, and then apply your wrap, okay? So this is the wrap, and there's a little dotted line here, and you're going to want to cut it just there, so you do not cut the wrap all crazy on accident. Um, and here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take it out of the pouch, and like I said, because I'm going to wrap, make this wrap really useful, and I don't want to just use one wrap for one area, I want to do my love handles, and I want to do my stomach. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the wrap, and I'm going to make sure I have the solution side. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the wrap right in the middle where the middle line is. And it doesn't have to be fancy cut. You can be perfectionist if you want to. I'm not a perfectionist, so my scissors are breaking on me. Okay. So now... Now I have a partial wrap, okay, and I really want to wrap the middle of my stomach because that's my problem area where my baby skin is from having kids, and I also want to wrap my sides. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the other half, okay, and I'm going to cut this, this one in half, right in the middle right here. Okay. okay. So now you have two more pieces that you can apply anywhere on your body. You want to tighten, tone, and firm. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply the wrap. Um, Junior, sit down. I'm going to apply the wrap on my stomach now. And what I'm going to do is, like I said, my problem area is right here, right in the middle, baby skin, you know, loose skin. And um, I've wrapped for quite a while, but I actually stopped for a few months, so um, I really just maintain with eating good, like I said. So I want to wrap the middle of my stomach. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my big piece, and I'm going to apply the thicker part to the bottom. And you want to make sure that it's on the solution side. So apply the thicker part to the bottom and I'm just going to apply my wrap to my problem area which is my middle of my stomach like I said sorry I keep repeating myself okay just smooth it down because I'm not worried about this area right here what I'm worried about is my middle so I'm just going to apply it like that and make sure that it and there's solutions on the wrap that tighten tone your skin. And then I got to take another piece and I'm going to put it on my side because I'm also working on my love handles. So I'm applying this on my side. And then I'm going to grab the other piece that I have. And I'm going to apply it on this love handle. I know it looks super silly, but you want to make your wraps, wraps useful, this is what you can do. It's just an option. Or you can watch my other videos and just apply the wrap all together like I normally do. This is just, I do it sometimes. So I don't have to use a lot of wraps. So then after you apply the where you want them, You're going to want to 
wrap yourself with saran wrap or something that's gonna hold it down. You really just want to see love handle covered, love handle covered, and it's super simple, you guys. Doesn't have to be hard. So then you just wrap, 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 wrap it enough to where you know it's not gonna move so you can still do what you gotta do during the day. And like I said, you cut your saran wrap thing in half and you're really doing yourself a favor. You don't have this big old thing and it really helps when you do your arms. You really help when you do your arms if you do that. So that's enough. Just wanted enough to hold it down Just a few times. So now what I do is I go in and I fix my wrap a little bit, make sure it's straight. And you're gonna feel an icy cold feeling. It's gonna tingle. Um, it's just the ingredients that are helping tighten your skin and tone. So after you're done applying your wrap and making sure it's all even, making sure it's held down good. I didn't put enough towards the bottom because I'm going to be moving around, so I really want to make sure it's not going to move on me. Okay, now I'm just going to leave my wrap on for 45 minutes, and I'm going to wait. That's it. All done. I applied my wrap in the center of my stomach and on my love handles. Um, like I said, you can just apply the wrap all the way on your stomach if that's what you prefer. You can put it on your back. You can put it anywhere you want to tighten, tone, and firm. Sides, back, stomach, arms, butt area, thighs. So I'm actually going to leave my wrap on for a couple hours. And then um, make sure you're taking before pictures. Um, I don't take before pictures anymore, really, unless I want to show my results um, the next day or something. Um, yeah, I think that's everything, guys. I hope this video helps you guys, and please feel free to contact me. Let me know if you have any questions. Don't forget to drink your water, and yeah, have a great day. Really, honey.